The Miss Mature pageant is a big event that comes around once a year to Irving and there is always a great turnout. The 29th annual Miss Mature pageant is on way and you can bet the contestants are getting their evening gowns picked and preparing those speeches. There are three competitions. The personality, which is a three minute speech about yourself so the audience can learn. Then there's a two minute, 45 second talent presentation and that can be singing, dancing, a monologue, a poem, showing your artwork. And the last thing they do, and surprisingly, a lot of people are the most terrified of this, is the evening wear. They model an evening gown, evening ensemble, but they answer a question from the judges. And this scares a lot of people because it's the unknown. Pat has been running the pageant for 21 years now. And with contestants like these, I'm sure she has more shows ahead of her. Oh, fun fun group, really dynamic personalities. I don't think there's a wallflower in the bunch. After speaking with a few of the ladies myself, Pat was definitely right. I've been threatening to do it and so I thought when I turn 60 I'm going to get in the Miss Mature Irving pageant and I said but Cynthia you're not mature <laughs> and I said but it's the chronological thing correct so. I love entertaining people. I love people. I'm a people person. And if I can do something to help someone, I will do it. This is Jessica's second year competing. And though she didn't win last year, she was voted Miss Congeniality. I've met so many beautiful people. The young ladies in this show, they're just, they're awesome. They're awesome. And our director, Pet, she is lovely, simply lovely. And likely enough, these ladies could all agree on what their favorite part of the competition is. Cracking some people's faces. <laughs> Probably the talent. Ooh, gotta say the talent. Gotta say the talent. There, a lot of ladies come up with things that I would never expect. I do Afro-Cuban. I do <laughs> head rolls. And I can spin very fast. <laughs> Regardless what the talent is, all these women have something special and are absolutely worth watching at this year's pageant. For Parkscape, this is Susan Kamyab reporting.